of I would like to present trash <laughs> it's actually the compost bit where the waste that we dispose would serve as nutrients for the surrounding greenery let's have a look at some of them the guava tree with its outstretched branches and leaves the papaya tree well there is no papaya only the flower through which grows one drumstick tree the tallest in the garden of course drumstick trees would have drumstick leaves <laughs> and a small palm shrub next to it sharp thorns for a small flower the christ plant here's an easy one the rain lily bunch of west indian jasmine flowers this seems familiar right the colocasia leaves do you also know that they're hydrophobic and with this we'll move on to explore other creatures in the garden cats like really a bunch of them obviously they don't live in the garden just play around or relax or try to annoy each other the mother watching from behind Cats also love one specific plant in this garden the roots of acalypha indica commonly known as kuppai meeni in tamil Here's a black ant trying to take honey from after all a flower bud. We can also find black ants often collecting milky juice secreted from mango leaves. Of course, it's almost the end of summer, the season of butterflies and caterpillars.
the caterpillar goes through metamorphosis which usually takes about 5 to 21 days depending upon the climatic conditions and gone Unfortunately, I wasn't able to find the butterfly. But let's try our luck with the lime caterpillar. Obviously, its name coming from it feeding on lime leaves. Again, <laughs> the butterfly probably found the garden inhabitable and left. And the other caterpillars seem to have disappeared too. Here's why and how. We can actually see a wasp dissecting a caterpillar and taking it home. Just wait, no. He even comes back to carry the remaining parts. Summer is almost over and so was butterfly season or so I thought I looked around the garden and found something under the leaves a last hope Oh no It's too late dark passing clouds once they collide would create thunderstorms and thus the rains have arrived heavy drops bouncing off the colocasia leaf the drooping rose flower under the chattering sound of rain new insects emerged the garden was still alive but the lonely butterfly stayed in safe